Hello there, today we will draw a smurf or a strumpf in French, the original name. So, we will start right in the middle with the nose. The nose is kind of a potato shape, so just go there, it's a kind of a warm-up situation. See, this is the nose, don't have to be too precise. Now we will start with the eyes, so you start here, almost in the middle, you do one kind of third of a circle, then you another one you go here and now bend here now those are the eyes eyebrow one two just on top of it now you can even do the eyes on the side he looks towards you you do another one here and you fill it out Now you already have the eye and now we will elaborate the whole thing around that so the first thing is the mouse so you start underneath the eye do a line like that that is the mouse now we just do i mean the upper, upper lip and now the mouse like that you fill that out and we're ready and recognize a bit what we are drawing. Now we have to frame that whole thing. So what do we do? We do kind of a banded line to the first eyebrow here. We continue that line here and now we go a bit more in a straight line on the same level as here at the mouse. So you go down here, straight down here. So this is already the head. Now from here we go and we do the ear. So just a bit before you go kind of over like a C. Try to draw a C. Then you do a parallel line inside. And this one comes back in the middle like that. And here you do a quarter of a circle and you fill it up. And you already have the ear. Now we connect that bit to close the face. So what I would suggest is you just put here a mark so you know where to go. You can go it this way or that way. I would try to do it that way. So I go normally the other way around. And you close it. Here you see. Now we already have the face pretty much done. They have sticking out ears, so we have to do one here. Best way is parallel and come back and this is the other ear so now we have the face we will go with the hat so just again to warm up right here in the middle of the nose up a line then and, and it goes back like that so now and here just whatever you take your, for example here you just go up like that and now we just do the whole kind of a loop so we start here between those two points here and now we go a reverse C and now you come down and try to get back to the ear here we go so now we also know that to give a little bit of uh, how should I say depth in the face we just do a line here comes here and now we fill it up so See, there's a bit of contrast. So the face is finished. And now we go for the rest of the body. So again, we warm up. In the continuation of the mouse here, we do a line, two fingers. And now we know that they don't have five fingers, they have four fingers, those Smurfs. So here we go. One, this is one finger. And here we go, the second one, close it. And we have third one we come back and here now we close this one here now we do parallel starting right in the middle of the mouse here down to here parallel and now we do the thumb so the thumb is like that go forward and you come back so we already have one hand we will have the other one here. And now we warmed up with the hand, so a line, kind of straight. 
We start the hand, the thumb, here. And now we have the fingers again. We have that one, now we have the three other ones. Now we do one, two, three. Now we come back to here. And now we do, this is the palm, so we do the inside of the hand and we do that line right in the middle, maybe the other one here. So you can see that's the inside of the hand. Now we do a parallel line to close the arm. Here. So now we have the arms, we need the body. So the body will be, you take kind of a here, half a finger, I would say, like this. And now we do the belly, and the belly goes like that. Up, back to here. See, this is the body. Now we know that they have long joints, so this is the top of his trousers or long joints. And now we go for the legs. So we do. One line like that, then you do two fingers away, mark it, two fingers, and you do the same thing here, parallel, but not as deep. Now you do a parallel line here, there, the third one here, and connection. So now we have the legs already, and now we have the feet, and they have huge feet, remember? So what we do is Kind of a potato shape again, and we come back, and here we go, and we do the same thing on the other side, this way, and then put in the back. So, pretty much finished, we do kind of little finishings, here we do this, and a little bit deeper here, same thing here, that's done already. Here, what you can do then is like make it a little bit darker like that gives you a bit more depth. Same thing here, connect this and you fill it out, and your smurf is finished. Mm -hmm.